And developing now, special counsel Robert Mueller is linking out details and his investigation into Russia election meddling. Yeah, he took to the podium today for the first public comments on his work since his investigation began back in 2017. Stacey Cohen has the details. After a nearly two-year investigation, special counsel uh, Robert morning, Mueller speaking everyone. out about Thank his report, for... both on the probe into Russian election meddling. Russian intelligence officers who were part of the Russian military launched a concerted attack on our political system. And on the issue of obstruction of justice, Mueller citing Department of Justice policy into the decision not to pursue charges against President Donald Trump. Under long-standing department policy, a president, president cannot be charged with a federal crime while he is in office. That is unconstitutional. But he added this. If we had had confidence that the president clearly did not commit a crime, we would have said so. We did not, however, make a determination as to whether the president did commit a crime. Mueller submitted his report to Attorney General William Barr on March 22nd. Barr released a letter summarizing his principal conclusions two days later, saying there was not sufficient evidence to establish that President Trump's campaign engaged in a criminal conspiracy with the Russian government. On April 18th, a redacted version of Mueller's report was released. Mueller closed his statement Wednesday with this warning to lawmakers and to the public. There were multiple systematic efforts to interfere in our election. And that allegation deserves the attention of every American. Washington, I'm Stacey Cohan.